Hello, welcome to Afro News South Africa. Please kindly subscribe and share. Turn the notification on so you would be notified each time we upload a new video. Suspended Secretary General of the ANC, Ace Magashul, says he is ready to carry out one of Jesse Duarte's dying wishes in the coming weeks. He has sensationally revealed that his fellow top sixer wanted to make a number of secrets about the ruling party known before her death. Duarte passed away on Sunday 17 July, following a battle with cancer. As an ANC stalwart, she was a much-loved and respected member of the party, even if she did have her critics elsewhere. However, it would appear that there are some things the senior politician didn't want to take to the grave. Ace Magashul addressed the media yesterday. The firebrand figure was solemn and somber, but just hours after Duarte's death, he revealed that the time will soon come to reveal the secrets she had shared with him over the years. While well, on her deathbed, it's understood that Jesse Duarte did tell Magashul not to reveal all of her bombshell mysteries. The SG himself says that his deceased colleague though some of the information was powerful enough to destroy the ANC, whether Ace's promise to make this classified information public was wholly appropriate, given the tragic circumstances of Duarte's passing, is another debate entirely. But the ANC could soon face a nightmare scenario, where a rogue official in possession of damning and potentially fatal secrets, could significantly harm the party's image. We'll be keeping our eyes peeled on this one. Again, it is true when they say death comes at the least expected times of our lives, and it takes away the person we least expected. What is even more worse is that the angel of death know no position or status, it visits everyone. Well, the angel of death has visited ANC again. Jesse Duarte, who worked as a special assistant to Nelson Mandela after he was released from prison, passed away recently. Mandela was a former president of South Africa. It was the year 68. The South African government party in power made the announcement of Duarte's passing on Sunday. Since November, she had been absent from work due to her cancer treatment, which she had been receiving throughout that time. In May 2021, after the incumbent Ace Magashul was suspended pending the outcome of his trial on corruption charges, Duarte was given the position of Interim Secretary General of the African National Congress ANC. A few days before she passed away Jacob Zuma had sent her a very warm and heartbreaking message. He sent her a video wishing her a speedy recovery that she get better and come back to serve her people. In the video, Zuma said that he heard that she's back in hospital, and he is very sorry for that. He went on to say he wishes her a speedy recovery, because there are so many things that she still has to do for the organization, as as well as for the country the way Zuma was talking was very emotional, one would swear that he was feeling that her days are numbered. It asks through that before someone dies, there is always a signal, this message was just a signal that something bad is about to happen. After this video was posted, many people claims that Zuma shouldn't bother to wish her speedy recovery, because he used to bully her during his term as president. May her soul rest in peace, and may God grant all of us strength to cope in this deficit times. Black Media sends its most sincere condolences to the family, may her soul rest peacefully. Leave your condolences in the comments section below. Don't forget to share with your family and friends.